what's up? It's Fat Boy Dan here. Nothing but redneck fishing all year. Fishing videos with all the beer and fun only at FatBoyDanFishing.com. The place for one of a kind type fishing with Fat Boy Dan from Indiana. You won't miss a thing. The greatest catches and product reviews. Catch them all with Fat Boy Dan Fishing videos. Live to fish, fish to live. This Fat Boy Dan Fishing. FatBoyDanFishing.com. Steve Stanford, that's right, up Stanford's Redneck Lawnmower Derby. It's another time to give them the preview for the St. Steve. That's right. We've got another one coming up June the 7th at the same place we ran the last one. Now, we got rained out a little bit on our last one, but hopefully this one here turns out better. You know, June's always good weather than, you know, than the last April showers. Oh, we didn't get rained out. We still had that oh, we derby. Was, we still ran it. We had a good derby for no more than what we did. I don't know, 25, 30 mowers still showed up, pouring down raining, mud ball going on. The crowd still showed up and watched it. The videos are on YouTube right now. If you haven't seen them, you need to check it out. The guys' derby's up. Jasmine, even your powder puff's up, right? You did what? Yep. What, what place do you get again, Bird? First. First place. And who are you representing? Pink Tonka. Y'all need to bring it. Pink Tonka. Pink Tonka, huh? <laughs> we got Team Terra Holt here too. Steve's representing. We're gonna be ready for this next one. We're out here working on the mowers. Jasmine, what's up with your mower? Running good? Running rough? What? Running really good. Running real good. Ready to bang again? Yep. Did your mower get messed up in the last one? No. No, just a little boo-boo on the front? Yeah. A little boo-boo? Yeah. Yep, I got my mower still going, as you can see. I'm got a little buckles here and there, but hey, that's not a 20-pound sledgehammer can't take out. Got Alan back here. Alan, you working on too, ain't you? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit here and there, a little bit there and there, you know. This don't need no work. Got the big ball toss back here. I don't know if I'm going to bring that one back out yet. Still needs a little bit more touches to it. Steve, you got yours going? Oh, she was ready. I was ready the next day. I just had to get my old hood out. I just had to run her a little extra hard the last time due to all that mud and water, and it, it got hot quick. And it, that mud was crazy. Yeah, for a little motor like that, it, it's hard on it. It gets it hot quick, and it, yeah. it just don't want to run right. But like I said, this one here's going to be a dry one, so we ought to have a pretty good one. I'll be a pretty good turnout with the crowd. And That's June 7th again. Yep. June 7th. Where's the address again? Uh, 6015 West Michigan Drive, uh, which is in Terre Haute, just south of Terre Haute, right there by the penitentiary. You all don't know where it is. We have signs posted up. It's just the first road past the U.S. penitentiary going south on 63. Uh, like I said, we have signs posted up you know, for the derby to get them back to there where we're at. Going south? Going south. Penitentiary, take a right. You, you won't miss it. It'll boom, boom, guide you around with signs. You're going north. It'll be the first left before you get to the penitentiary. Actually, the wife, she also went and picked up the trophies they come to think of. It. Really? Yeah, picked up trophies. I bet they're Pretty. beautiful, too. Oh, nice trophies. Yes, they are. Man, that's beautiful. I mean, they're, they're, in, this, in the derbies here, you get the you get the cash payout along with the trophies for what? One, two, three? First through third on the cash payouts, and then first through fifth on the trophies for the men's division. And when we have the powder puff, we got the first through third. Yep, and let, let's clear something up real quick. We're going to throw a little details up in this one. You can use self tapping screws on your hood. You can use self tapping screws. And also, a, a lot of, I've that. had a lot of calls on this, Dan. Uh, like, for instance, <laughs> like the hood brackets. If they broke off, if they're the original hood brackets and they're tore off from the frame, you can either bow them back on. Or if you got a stick welder, you can. I, I, I do allow them, you know what I mean, to replace the parts that's broke off. Right? No. That's it. Now, we, we, ain't put, we ain't putting uh, Spell your name iron well. brackets back yeah. on there. We're putting the original brackets, you know. These are line mowers, not derby them. cars. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. we don't try to run You can put your foot guards on if you wish. You can put leg guards on. But like I said the last time, you can run them if you want. A lot of them don't run them. <laughs> if you do decide to run leg guards, make sure that those leg guards will hold up. And they only hold up for your legs. They ain't trying to protect your tractor. No tire protectors, no bumpers on the back, unless it's a factory bumper or something. You there's, know? there's a lot of modifications you can do. You can run dualies, you can run chains, you can run wheel weights, you can uh, foam fill your tires, you that can change your pulleys. of this derby. You can change your pulley sizes out, you know, if you want to gain Fast, a little quick, speed. Fast, quick, torque to push somebody, uh, fastness to hard hit you somebody. You can governor your throttles. You there's, know that's how we do it. There's governor. a few different modifications you can do, you know. Uh, I don't know how that banging one that one day, boy. A lot of coming, wheel weights on the back, smacking people. Don't Man. run that one this time, Alan. 
Oh boy, we're gonna be places belt and stuff. He said, Oh, like, and uh, uh, what was it, Mad Cow? Mad Cow. I just seen him up on YouTube, uh, YouTube too, man. He's got another one going, and he got another buddy gonna be running up in it. They're gonna good. be banging. I think that other one's called UFO or something. Mad Cow's coming back. He did a pretty back. good job. I like that dude. That, yeah. That little lawnmower came out there and put them big lawnmowers to shame. Wait till you see the one he's got now. I seen it on YouTube. He's, he had to change the pulleys on it. Looks like he's got a little beast. He be running the small lawnmowers too. So you come out and you see all these these ones like I got back here with the big duels on it. Don't let that scare you. Don't let that scare you. Jasmine's got a little lot more here. I've got a little lot more here. This lot more has been through four, five, six, seven derbies. A lot of derbies. A lot of derbies. I mean, the small derby won third place last time. First place. I forgot. Was that small lot more? Big lot more? Uh, that was medium size. One that Mo uh, Sears Suburban took first. Place. Yeah, Sears Suburban. That's a decent size. Yeah. Bigger one took second. Third place was. Mad cow with the little baby lawnmower. I mean, all you gotta do is have that baby to last out there. Last. You know, you don't need all these welds nope. and all this other stuff. But we just we just out here to bang them. We want your rims to fall off, we want your tires to fall off, we don't care. And, uh, Cobra. Actually, that's right. Cobra over in Brazil, he, he was putting a hammer down out there, wasn't he? Steve, boy, he was. That's Cobra. Our Brazil Steve. Army team, which I've, they've talked to me already, they're coming back again for this one. Oh, they always are. They always yeah. are. Yeah. Man, and that nightmare, woo, that, that, that nightmare really did scare me, though. <laughs> it was a hell of a lot They got a pretty good team together. Yeah, they got, a, they got a real good team, though. Like we said, there ain't no teaming up, but you're more than welcome to get you a team together. Like, I, we got Team Tonka, Team Terre Haute, Team USA, uh, Brazil. Brazil Billies, right, I think it's called. I mean, all teams, you know, because that's our little cruise. But when we get out there, I will come and I will smack my own teammate, Team Tonka. <laughs> I will bust anybody's ass. I don't care. I'll be out there just having fun. It's all competition, all fun. Y'all need to come out to the Derby, at least watch. It's free to come out and watch. Food, there's food for refreshments you can purchase. Free to get in, and like I said, free to get in. We don't charge a damn dime to see this. No parking fees. No parking, free to come out. What do you got to lose? Besides your gas driving in to get there, and we're located right in Terre Haute. Easy to get to, easy to leave. Good. Brazil guys are talking about putting one on for us too. Uh, yep. Over there, I, they hadn't contacted me back, but they're talking about it. Well, we ran one over on 200 West here last year. Yeah. That's pretty good. Little yeah. Level. That nice little slope to it. I mean, banging out there and everything. This is going to be uh, my last derby on my part, as for now, for this year until September at the Corey Apple. Corey, yeah. wrapping up the big Corey. And, uh, we got some big things going on for that one too. The old lady's going to uh, get some lot larger trophies, a lot nicer trophies for that derby. Yeah. Uh, due to the end of the year event. Yeah, I've already talked to a few people uh, that was with the court. They just asked me the other day. I was up there. How was that? Jim, Jim's Marine the other day. Yeah. He's friends with some of the people there. I was talking about, man, he's like, yeah, I heard you guys come back to the quarry. And he's like, man, they, they loved you guys last time. They really appreciate how we cleaned up after that. They said, mm -hmm. that's well, the hopefully, uh, yeah, the Snake now. contacted me a couple weeks back, which is part of the Brazil team. Uh, Snake's contacted me and uh, asked me about running the derby. And I told him to put one on for us over there. And we'll be glad to come with, you know, around yep. with them guys. Yep. Takes a little part off when you got stuff to do, you know. I got fishing tournaments coming up. You got uh, derby I car got derbies. Regular car derbies to do also. Graduation. So. Graduation. That's a big part. You can't miss graduation. Yeah, my daughter's graduating. So. Oh, don't cry. Don't start crying. <laughs> Let me give you hugs. Man, that's it though. We we gotta wrap this up. I'm gonna sit here and drink all this beer, and I'm gonna be like talking all day. We gotta get Come these motors going. Fun. I enjoy it, and I'm gonna help Dan out here rest of the afternoon. See what can't get going on around here, and hope to see everybody out there. Yeah. Right. Like we we'll said once time. again. Free to come watch, free parking, food, refreshments, everything. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 like the lady said, bring chairs because we don't provide the chairs. And the B.O.B. Oh, yeah, B.O.B., bring your own alcohol. Yes, right, we do allow alcohol at this if you need it. But, hey, you can even bring your own clues. You want to bring your own snacks, Pop? Yeah, go ahead and do it. That's it, this one here in Terre Haute. But you know what? There's also good food out there, too. Well, you also want to thank 50 50 drawings 50 50, uh, and a raffle tractor. I believe there's a ra raffle tractor there, too. You had a hell of a raffle tractor in that last one, big heavy duty one. Yeah. We're wrapping it up, man. We got to get back to this stuff, man. Like yeah, I said, travelwithamfishing.com, Team Tonka, Team we're out. Y'all take it easy. Sledgehammer back up. Hey, you, what's up? It's Fat Boy Dan here. Nothing but redneck fishing all year. Fishing videos with all the beer and fun only at FatboyDanFishing.com. The place for one of a kind type fishing with Fat Boy Dan from Indiana. You won't miss a thing. The greatest catches and product reviews. Catch them all with Fat Boy Dan Fishing videos.
Live to fish, fish to live. This fat boy damn fishing. Fatboydamnfishing.com